Last day, best day. I was really debating if we wanted to go for a hike or not. I actually struggled trying to find a hike in California because there are still a decent amount of trails that are closed. And then I was gonna go to Joshua Tree, but I don't know, I'm just like kind of not feeling it. Like I just wanna drive and get there. And today's a short day anyways. So yeah, I like don't really feel the need to go for an extra hike. Plus the fancy's honestly exhausted from all the hiking and stuff that we have done. So what else? I don't know. As of right now, we're supposed to arrive at like 1.30, but I don't think I can get in until three or four. I'm waiting for the person to message me back and let me know. With that being said though, obviously Fancy and I are gonna stop. We're gonna use the bathroom. We're gonna get lunch and all of that. So I think we'll be fine on time. If not, maybe we'll drive around LA. I probably won't do that just because I don't know where I'm going and I don't have a purpose. So that was a long intro. You guys didn't care to hear all of that. There's a car coming. Okay. Mother bing, mother boom, Mr. Robot. When I step into the room, I'm a hustler, baby. Don't ask me why that just came into my head. We are currently 35 minutes away from my Airbnb. At first, Fancy's freaking out. At first, we were supposed to be able to check in at three o'clock, but apparently the cleaning team is taking a little bit longer, so I'm gonna be checking in around four. It's 3.01 right now. I've got time to kill, so what I ended up doing, I went to the bathroom, I went into Target and did just like a quick little shopping spree. It's only 65 degrees out, so I had the windows like cracked and Fancy was all good and it's not even close to being hot, but I did like, a quick little shopping spree. I got the necessities. So I got eggs, sourdough, almond milk, just like stuff that I needed for breakfast tomorrow, as well as beer and wine because you know you need it. Oh, I also got my green juice. So I got those things at Target and then I was like, you know what, I still need to waste time. So I just filled up with gas. I didn't necessarily need gas. Like I was a little under half a tank. And then they had a car wash. You see my shirt? I need to take it to a good car wash, but I was like, just to get some of the stuff off of it, let's just go into like a gas station car wash where you pull in and then it's got like those things that move around you. I was like, that's fine, that's what we'll do. Oh, Fancy hates car washes so, so freaking much. So, so freaking much. She ended up in my lap. Like my shirt is gross. Like I don't even, like what, what is, what, what are those marks? Okay. Well, update on the car wash. Side of the car looks good. Looking good. What? Why? Why? So I'm definitely gonna be taking my car to a different car wash. <laughs> that one didn't even get the front at all. Like it went the whole way around the back, but I noticed as it was going, I was like, it's not swooping around the front. It's only like going the sides and then the back. <sighs> the front of my car is what needed it the most. So. We'll be going to another car wash without fancy this week. You guys, we made it. We're freaking here. I haven't seen the house yet. I was letting fancy just do like her walk through, sniff everything. I brought everything inside the house. Now I've got shoes off. And we're ready. I'm, I'm so excited. Like just first look. Oh my God, look at the back area. Oh, that's so cute. Baby, look at that. Look at the airplane. You wanna come here? Oh my gosh, it's so cute out here. Oh my gosh, this is so, so freaking cute. Okay, well Fancy's checking out the outside. Stop. Stop, this is so cute. You got the bedrooms. Oh my gosh, the freaking bathrooms. <gasps> Bedroom number one. Oh, so cute. Okay, 
Bedroom number two. Oh, I think we're taking bedroom number two. It doesn't have as good of closet space, but I've got this whole entire freaking house to myself. <gasps> Guys! Oh, it's gorgeous. This is unreal. Let's start. This is the entry area of the house. Ignore all of my stuff. Cute little couch. We've got a TV up there. I did bring Fancy's dog bed as well as dog toys for her to play with, but cute little mirror. Hey, yo, what's up, guys? Then you got Fancy coming in, but it goes the whole way through. Like as soon as you open the door, you can see the whole way through. So we've got this cute dining room area right here. Love it. Then this little kitchen. It's actually, it's big. It's, it's not a little kitchen. It is absolutely perfect. If we come over here, we've got, guys, these floors. Like, I need these floors in my house. They're amazing. But we've got a little bathroom right here, which is great, as well as a washer dryer, which I'm going to be using. Oh my gosh, that light is like motion sensitive or something because it just turned on. Okay, and then if we go through this little hallway, first up, guys, the bathroom floors. I'm telling you, the bathroom sold me on this place, but... How cute is this? Like, I need, I need. You guys know I'm not a gold person. So if this was like a black mirror, I'd like it even more. But oh my gosh, so, so stinking cute. Then we have this bedroom over here. Just got a little queen bed. You got a chair, all of this storage, which is awesome. And then bedroom number two, which this is the one I think I'm going to use because... I think this is a king, and you guys know I like kings. Full-length mirror, smaller closet over here, but that's totally fine. And look how big this TV is. Oh my gosh. Fancy. Fancy. Oh my gosh. So when I was looking for places, uh, obviously I needed at least a one bedroom. I wanted a whole house to myself. I'm just confirming that I'm locked in here. I wanted a whole house to myself. I didn't want to just like rent a room or like a small apartment or something because I wanted a backyard for fancy. So we've got a backyard for fancy here. I wanted to have like enough space for working. So like I can work on the couch here. I could work on the table or I could work outside. Like there's so many options for working. And of course guys, because I'm going to be filming here, I needed it to be like, fitting my aesthetic, you know, had to. I needed to make sure that I could film in this space and it would just be beautiful. And I'm so, so freaking happy with it, oh my gosh. It's gorgeous, but I need to get this girl some water and food, cause I'm sure you're hungry, huh? Are you hungry? Yeah? Okay, let me get you food. Time to unpack and put things in their places. Officially have everything unpacked, like the bathroom. I've got all of my stuff right here. Wait, can I actually show you guys? This freaking shower. Oh, serious goals. That's what I want to do in my master bath. Although I don't really want to change the shower head. Like I want to do this. Maybe I will change the shower head in our master bath. I don't know. But the bathtub 
the spigot has like gold in it and you guys know gold is not my vibe so at home i would love to change it to matte black i just freaking love that look but everything is unpacked in its place food is in the fridge i've got my little workstation like camera gear everything set up over there i've got this is going to be my actual workstation right here, charging. I've got my iPad charging. Everything is in its place. But what I want to do, because you guys know Fancy is a bed sleeper. She sleeps on the bed. She cuddles hard, but she sheds like crazy. And I did specifically buy a lint roller so that I can lint roll whatever like her fur gets on. But the comforter, it's like a duvet and it's pure white. And I just like, for two weeks of Fancy sleeping on it, Mm -mm, no way so once fancy comes back inside i am gonna go and i'm gonna run to target there's actually one that's only like a mile away from here which is freaking awesome so i'm gonna run to target and i'm gonna try to get a king size blanket that then i can obviously bring back with us but that's gonna then be our comforter for this week because i just like i can't do that oh my gosh wait do you hear the airplane this is the perfect spot like there's a little floating shelf right here this is perfect for filming oh my gosh i need to like set my house up in a better way for filming i wish my kitchen was actually better because my kitchen is so dark and there's no spots to set a camera but there's no way of reworking my kitchen i'm just gonna wait for this dog to come back inside and then i'm gonna go to target and i'll see you guys another day we are finally here in LA. I can't believe it. I don't know how much I'm gonna vlog while I'm here. Honestly, I don't even know what the heck I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hike to go see the Hollywood sign with a friend from high school. Very excited about that. I'm obviously going to see my little sister, Jen. I'm freaking excited to see you. And then I'm just gonna be like working, hanging out. I will explore a little bit of LA. Yeah, I think we may Postmates dinner tonight. Fancy is just like doing little mini sprints in the backyard and it is so, so freaking cute. I'm so glad that I found her a place that has a fenced in backyard and actual grass. She's gonna, she's gonna love it. They also have little tennis balls here, which is cute, but I did bring Fancy's whole toy bag, basket thing. Anyways, I am gonna have to go pick up this dog poop. I'll see you guys later. Bye guys. <laughs>